Hi guys, this is Scott with Motorsportsland in Salt Lake City. Um, today we're going to be taking a look at the new 2017 R Pod 180. This is the first of the R Pod edition of the trailers that actually has not a wet bath but a real bathroom. So it's something that a lot of people have been asking for. It's nice that R Pod was able to, to, to give that to everybody. Um, here in Salt Lake City, we have the Hood River Edition. So the Hood River Edition has the larger 15-inch tires, bigger axles, aluminum wheels. It's got better insulation, you know, stainless steel wheel wells. Um, it's a lot better build for how we camp out here in the West, where we're typically going to be going off-road, or at least want the capability to, to do that. Um, so coming around the front of the trailer, you can see it's a, it's a nice shiny fiberglass trailer. It's got an aluminum frame. It's got brick foam insulation, so it's actually really a solid trailer outside speakers um, coming around to the front you've got really good storage underneath all the sofas and seating on the inside you've got scissor jacks on all four corners those are the good scissor jacks that give you really good stability um, you've got a five gallon propane tank on the front generally it's enough to last you the whole season with the insulation this has got um, two batteries will go in this tray and your waste hose goes in that tube right there because you have a receiver on the back of this instead of a hitch Nice light up front to give you something to, to look at while you're loading up or doing stuff. Um, six gallon hot water heater with a 12 recovery. That's nice, you can get about 18 gallons of a shower or something before you start running cold or dishes, whatever you need to do. Um, fresh water connection, this is a neat deal. So you can actually pour the fresh water in here. It's got 36 gallons fresh, 30 gray and 30 black. But if you're at a camp, you know, campground you can plug into here and pressurize the whole trailer but if you're going dry camp and you can top it off if you're running low on water you can just pour water back in here instead of having to take the whole trailer someplace to load it up or do it with a pressure system um, nice big kitchen slide here you'll see that from the inside hot cold shower on the outside your dump valves black tank flush probably the greatest invention I think that the trailers have come up with it's got an actual spray system that's inside your black tank. So you turn that on and instead of having to take a hose all the way in the trailer and using the wand or fill it up and empty it, it just turns on a sprinkling system which sprays out the black tank. Really, really great. Very clean feature about that. Um, nice big, real full-size spare that's gonna match all the, the, the bigger tires around the whole trailer. So if you have an incident, you're not what's left with some little mini tire. Um, again, coming around, you've got really good storage. You'll also notice that all the storage has a magnet. So it's a lot easier instead of the little clips that tend to always break on you. But really good storage through there. Solar on the side. That's such a neat deal. It's kind of the movement that everybody's going towards the solar power. You're able just to plug your solar panel in, have an instant you know, power from that recharging your batteries. But it's instead of the expense of putting it on top, and if you sell your trailer, it's just kind of gone, you're able to take that with you to your next trailer. So it's a really, really nice feature. Nice big grab handle. Nice friction hinge door so you don't have to worry about latches that can break off. Coming inside, right off the start, you've got really good where it's either wardrobe or pantry. It's got shelves, but it's also got a, a bar in there, so you can decide what you know, more important to you and use it for that way. Real nice big drawers, just really good storage. In a small, compact 18-foot trailer like this, it's important to use everything you can for, for storage. Um, coming around to the kitchen side, you've got all your monitors here where you can see what you've got battery power fresh black gray um, also got your hot water heater and your water pump um, you've got a digital furnace control here that allows you to set the temperature that you want and it'll stop right at it um, nice big countertop what this slide really gives you is the ability to have this back spot here so you've got a lot better slide a lot better walking room in the trailer it's amazing what just a few, a few feet of a width will do nice big stainless steel sink high-rise faucet You've got a double burner in this unit. You've got really good storage through all of these cabinets. Metal ball bearings glide nice and easily. You've got a nice window there for cooking as well as more storage up top. Um, we bring all of ours in with a convection microwave. It's just nice to know that you can either you know, cook by microwave or by oven, depending on what you're trying to cook. This is also the largest three-way refrigerator. It's either 110 power, gas, or battery. Coming around, you've got a queen size bed up front. It's a really nice, nice size bed for adults. Um, windows on both sides, screens, cross ventilation, LED lights throughout the whole trailer so that you know they're, they're, they're cool to the touch. They also use 160th the battery power of an incandescent light. Um, you've got an AM FM CD DVD player, it's MP3, Bluetooth, control it with your phone, 
hooked to the Jensen TV system. You can swing that around and watch it wherever you're at within the trailer. Nice big window here for the dinette. Kind of, kind of a trailer that's maybe, you know, built for, built for two. You know, that does drop down into a bed, so you could sleep three in here really easily. Just coming down. Um, coming out of the back, you actually, again, the, the benefit of the RPOD 180, just one of them, is that it actually has a, an actual bathroom instead of what they call a wet bath, where your shower's, you know, inside where you're sitting on the toilet using it. So you've got good storage through here, more through here, an actual toilet, then a separate shower stall here in the corner. And then you've got, again, more storage through here and a sink. Um, again, you guys, my name is Scott with Motorsportsland in Salt Lake City. Thanks for taking a look at the new 2017 RPOD 180.